Hello, and welcome to Artisan Quick Tips with Jennifer. I'm Jennifer Wise, and I'm going to show you a couple of things that you can do in Artisan digital scrapbooking software um, in order to make photos round if they're square photos or oval if they are um, rectangular photos, as well as just how to add little rounded corners to your photos without making them completely round. So that's what we're going to look at today in quick tips. Um, I wanted to, uh, if you are not familiar with Artisan, just give you a few um, fast facts about Artisan. So here are some facts about Artisan, things to know what it is, what it can do. If you are new to Artisan, go ahead and pause this recording and, and um, learn about Artisan. Down at the bottom is uh, my website where you can buy Artisan if you don't have it and my email where you can ask me questions. Um, if you like this video and find it helpful, please like thumbs up it on YouTube so that other people can find it easier. And if you want more artisan quick tips, be sure to subscribe to the channel. <clears throat> okay, so I am now going to show you um, about rounding photos and um, rounding just the corners. So I'm going to open my artisan program. I've got a couple of pictures pulled up already and some cute little background paper that I chose. Um, and I want to show you how to, how to drag a picture onto your paper as well. So <clears throat> after you click get photos and you upload photos from your computer or a flash drive or wherever you have them, they'll show up here and you can click and drag them over. Um, everything that comes that you drag over, whether it's a paper or a little, you know, bow or anything, photo, will um, not automatically have its aspect ratio locked, which means if you want to make it bigger, you can accidentally do this or on purpose. I mean, maybe you're doing it on purpose too. Um, <clears throat> but if you don't want it to do that, let me just go ahead and click undo here. You can right click on it and select aspect ratio and then lock the aspect ratio. So that will be another artisan quick tip, but I'm gonna show you that right now here as well. Okay, so I have three pictures here. I want to do three different things. So with a square photo, I'm going to um, make it into a circle. So in order to do that, you come up to the top of your screen here. You're, you've got all these tabs, home, insert, arrange, et cetera, et cetera. Click the one called photo and underneath that, this ribbon will show and you want to select mat. Once you do that, um, and this is another artisan quick tip video as well, but you can put mats around it. But what we're going to do here is select not a mat, but just a shape, a circle. So once I click circle, you can see that my perfectly square photo is now a perfectly round circle. If your photo is not a square, if it is, oops, I have to click okay to save that. There we go. If it is like this one, which is a, you know, landscape or well, this one's portrait, but you may have landscape photos as well. They're more rectangle. They're not square. You do the same thing. You click mat and then you click still the circle and it will make your photo an oval super fast way to um, be able to do that very, very quick. Now, let's say on this photo down here, I don't particularly want it to be an oval. It's never gonna be a circle because it isn't square. Um, I just wanna round the corners a little bit. So you go through the same process, the photo tab, um, select map from the ribbon, and, but instead of selecting circle, we're gonna select right here, which is just rounded corners. So I can, click it right there and you can see what happened to my photos. It's just a little bit of a rounded corner. And again, click okay to save. All right, so that's a quick tip, how to make your photos into either circles or ovals or how to just round the corners to soften them up a little bit. Thanks for watching Artisan Quick Tips with Jennifer. Don't forget to like this video if it was helpful and subscribe to the channel to find more videos.